Good morning, this is Alden Bynum live here in New Orleans, and the Alabama Crimson Tide just defeated the LSU Tigers 29-0. Didn't I tell y'all what was going to happen? <laughs> Good morning. You on y'all way to church? Oh, yeah. LSU fans, you're going to need the Lord this morning. And Alabama fans, you know, we, we, we need the Lord too. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we need the Lord too, but. <sighs> you we want, we, we, nobody, y'all don't want Bama, dog. Say, bro. Wasn't it, wasn't it awesome? Wasn't it a beautiful thing? Quentin Davis? Is it Quentin Davis? Quentin Williams. Four sacks. <laughs> ah, yeah, it feels good. Well, y'all wish y'all could feel like how we feel. Don't you, LSU fans? Had an accident down there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, laid the smackest. Down on that behind last night. Oh. And I'm going to tell you, Mississippi State should have beat LSU. Because they defense, they near did. I think we probably outplayed their defense. We played just alike. Right? That's why this game for us is going to be kind of good and interesting next week. Because if they had a better quarterback situation and they had better play calling by the coach, because they got just as much talent as uh, – as LSU too, right? They should have, they was running the ball on LSU. If the dude could have passed the ball one time, or they could have got a first down, something. Well, they got a couple of first downs. They could have just need to score one touchdown, right? They could have beat LSU. LSU, Joe Barrow has not thrown a touchdown pass in over a month. In about, about a month. Right at five, five, four weeks. Because it was off last week. I'm going to count that one. Because he wouldn't have done it anyway. And, you, and once I saw, well, he, he couldn't do nothing against me. I'm like, come on, Mississippi State, y'all in this game. But, you know, once the you, you, got, you get a better... Uh, uh, what's the word I don't use phrase? Uh, you get a better supporting cast as, as far as your coordinators and your coach. You know, then you probably got a you know some talent in the arm. They just boy, and that's why I was like, hold on, I take LSU. At first, I was like, they're gonna pull. Like I made a video last week, they're gonna pull away with about eight minutes left in the fourth, which they kind of did at the same time too. But I went home. And I looked at the Mississippi State LSU game. And you can't tell me you were impressed. I told y'all in another video that LSU, dog, when they played against La Tech and they played against Southeast, South, uh, Southeastern, like, come on, dog, that wasn't impressive to me. Right? It wasn't impressive. It was not an impressive 19-3 against, and you didn't score a passing touchdown. Tua threw more touchdowns than, your, than the LSU quarterback has thrown right in a whole month. And that's sad. So you are overrated and overvalued. You know, and it's, it's cool. It's good when, when, uh, when your team is liked by, you know. But it's no excuses. You got what you wanted. You wanted Bama, and you got it. Oh Lord, and you got it. That's what you wanted. You got it. So you ain't got no excuses, dog. You don't got no excuses, right? Take all that smoke that was given. Go, go humble thyself, or go just chill on out. Just chill on out, like just chill on out, just chill on out. Twenty nine to nothing. Twenty nine, and then. And then you in the red zone at the end of the game and throw an interception. Y'all had two chances to score. Three points. It wouldn't have gave y'all six y'all about it, right? Still didn't do it. 
number one defense in the nation, Alabama. Alabama. And I just got to say, man. Woo. So no LSU. Y'all not getting back up there because the, cause the committee. Let me tell you, the committee and the computers, whatever y'all won't call it. Michigan in there. Right? LSU, y'all not get back there. Back there. Georgia has earned their way back in that area. And even when y'all beat Georgia, it wasn't impressive. It was at the crib. Right? Georgia turned the ball over four times. The quarterback threw two interceptions and two other turnovers happened. And you still, and guess what? He still did throw a touchdown pass in that game. So this has been Alden Bynum. Once again, another year has been put in the books. Alabama, LSU. And the results of the 2018 contest end 29 to nothing with a victory by the Crimson Tide of Alabama, of the University of Alabama. This has been Alden Bynum. Subscribe, like, dislike, and we won't fail. Get out of here. Have a good one.